Hi guys, um, today I'm going to film a Natalie Portman makeup tutorial. I'm going to work so hopefully it won't be too um, rushed. <laughs> but anyway, I'll get started. I'm going to start with um, MAC Paint Pot and Painterly. And that's going everywhere as a base. Okay, um... Okay, I'm doing one of her uh, more smoky eye looks. Um, and the look that I'm using as a visual, um, she has basically like um, a dark taupey browny color and also a light brown. And I think if I mix some stuff from my um, Inglot palette that I made, um, it'll be pretty good. You can see all the finger marks on it. <laughs> um, I'm going to start by using a mix of these two colors right here. This one's like a sparkly taupe. And this one's um, a sparkly metallic warm brown. Uh, that's going to go on the outside corners of um, my upper and lower lid. That color also goes up here like this very, very lightly. Now I'm just putting a little bit of that taupe over the top. Now um, I'm going to use this light brown color right, right here. It's going to go all over the rest of the eyelid. Also on the bottom and now this beige color and that's going to go in the very inner corner so that's pretty much it for eyeshadow now I'm taking um, this tiny tiny eyeliner brush um, from Sephora it's just called eyeliner. It's silver and it's like really, really tiny. It's all frayed out right now, but it's tiny. And then my Makeup Forever Professional um, Waterproof Cream Eyeshadow. And um, this is really like subtle. It's not key to the look at all. It's just really to define. Uh, I'm just putting a really, really thin line on my uh, upper lid, the lash line. I'm not even going to wing that eyeshadow out, or that eyeliner out, because uh, it doesn't look like she has um, anything at all, really. So the eyeliner should be really, really subtle, just like that. It's just a really, really thin line. just for definition now I'm taking a black pencil eyeliner um, this is from Arbonne International and it's called Eclipse 
looks like this. It's self sharpening, or it's supposed to be. There we go. And I'm putting that on the uh, waterline all the way in uh, to the inner corner, and also I'm going to tight line the top waterline. So you should, it should look like that when you're done. So that's it. So it looks from the side. I almost never do makeup like this, so, well I, I don't think I ever have done makeup like this, so it's pretty fun. <laughs> she also has some on her bottom lashes. Um, I might put on a second coat of mascara at the end, but for now, this is the way it looks. Um, I'm also going to attempt to do Natalie Portman's eyebrows, which I've always been so jealous of. They're really straight across and beautiful. I'm going to use um, Concrete from MAC. And uh, a little angled brush from Sephora that I used in another recent video. So the bottom should look kind of like that. I'm just using Beauty Marked, even though it's sparkly, it's not really going to show up on here. Um, but I'm using it just to create a bit of depth, because they don't look like my eyebrows at all. <laughs> so these are my Natalie Portman eyebrows. I actually think I did a really good job. Now I'm going to apply my foundation. It's Arbonne Perfecting Liquid Foundation in Fair. Then I'm just going to do lips before I do the rest of my face. I'm using Max Jubilee lipstick. It's like a peachy, beigey color that she wears pretty often. Now I'm going to do some bronzer. I'm using Too Faced Snow Bunny bronzer and a big kind of a, oh, it's called bronzer brush. I think it's from Quo, I'm not sure. And I'm gonna put the bronzer on my cheekbones and up on my temples and on the sides of my forehead.
I'm also putting a bit of my nose and chin and jawbone. She seems to be wearing a really nice, um, kind of a peachy pink blush in this picture too, so I'm using Max Spring Sheen. And I'm just going to put that on the apples of my cheeks. Okay, I have to leave like now for work. <laughs> so this is the finished look. Um, I hope you see that it's Natalie Portman. Um, and that's it. Thanks for watching and please subscribe. Bye.